But I want to give a shout out. I believe his full name is Kevin Copps. Uh, the pitcher, the closer for Arkansas who's going to win the Golden Spike Award was absolutely incredible in college baseball this year. He's a closer but he pitched basically the entirety of the game for the Arkansas Razorbacks in a much must-win game. And in the top of the ninth inning he gave up a home run to NC State. Cops did. Final pitch of his career at Arkansas. The number one overall seed, the Razorbacks, eliminates them from competition. Devastating way for your college career to end. Baseball can be extremely cruel sometimes in the suddenness with which incidents such as those can happen during games. They cut to the crowd and you could see cops crying inside of the dugout. Later, after the game was over, cops came outside to Razorback Stadium and went around for over an hour and signed every kid's autograph request inside of Razorback Stadium. You want to talk about an incredible testament to Cops' character to probably have the most devastating moment of his college career and maybe his athletic career happen. You give up a home run in the top of the ninth inning. Your team loses by one run after you came out of the bullpen to start the entire game. You are bawling in the dugout as you come out of that game knowing that you might well never put on your college uniform again. And after your team is eliminated as the overall number one seed, you go around the entire Razorback Stadium signing for every kid that wants your autograph for over an hour. Do you know what kind of character that requires? Do you know what kind of mental toughness that requires? Do you know what kind of perspective that requires to be a college kid be hit in the face with the most devastating outcome that could happen in your athletic career and then be selfless enough that you are thinking about all the Razorback fan kids that are there in the stadium that you want to help feel a little bit better because they desperately wanted to win too. I just got to give a shout out. I don't know how much attention this will get from other people. But for Arkansas pitcher Kevin Copps to make the choice let me make sure I'm not messing up his first name because I'm not pretending to be a genius when it comes to uh, when it comes to uh, college uh, college baseball. Kevin Copps. For him to have the wherewithal the mental toughness the character tenacity and perspective to make that choice tells me a ton about him. I think about it from the perspective of a dad now, right? I've got three boys. I love to see my kids win. I much prefer seeing my kids lose and still maintain their overall ability as humans. Because it's easy to win with grace. It's incredibly difficult if you are hyper-competitive to lose, to get back up off the mat and go again. And to me, what Kevin Copps did right after that difficult loss for the Arkansas Razorbacks is what all of us should hope that our sons or ourselves will do in the face of great disappointment. Get yourself back up, dust yourself off, and get right back into the fray I don't know what Kevin Copps' future is going to be but I would like to buy stock in it right now. Not based on how well he pitched which was very well in that game Arkansas against NC State but based on the way that he responded to one of the most difficult losses that you could possibly have. Props to Kevin Copps in a big way for how he responded to an incredibly difficult situation. (laughs) 